Hello everybody. Uh, this video is going to be rather interesting. Um, I've got these 17 bottles of water that I've gathered from um, different countries over the world. I used to be in the um, Air Force and uh, each place we went to I always kept a bottle of water, a random bottle of water from a hotel or whatnot. And I ended up with a quite, a, quite a collection of water. And uh, what I want to do in this video is just going to test each one of these waters and figure out which one tastes the best and which ones which ones are horrible tasting um, and try to see if, if any of them compare to um, Evian. Um, some of the countries we got, we got Azerbaijan, uh, Hawaii, which is not a country obviously, but uh, I got some water from Qatar, France, Guam, Guatemala, Mexico, Spain, Greece, Afghanistan, Mauritania, which is a country, the western side of uh, Africa. Um, it's got Arabic writing on it, and I think French on one side. Um, Oman, USA, Nestle water. Uh, this one's from Cyprus. Latvia, Kyrgyzstan, and Japan. And uh, I'm going to blindfold myself and, uh, on these taste tests so I don't have any kind of bias toward any certain country or waters. Um, I'm going to go ahead and crack the lids and pour pour about half a cup or so in, the, in these uh, cups and then uh, we'll, get, we'll get the test started. We're just cracking all these cat, uh, bottles of water on camera so that way, just to show that these are sealed bottles. That it's not, um, they're not empty bottles been refilled with tap water. Good old rye and boy, we drink plenty of that stuff when we in Qatar. <laughs> I definitely do not miss drinking that every day. Of course, who knows that might end up being the best water out of all of them. Japanese water. Cyprus. USA. Oman. The water wasn't bad. Mauritania. I recall, I remember looking in this bottle, you could actually see particles floating in it. I don't think I would pick up on camera though, interesting enough. And last but not least is grease. Alright, uh, let me get this. Homemade blindfold on. We can 
get started here. Of course, I better sit down first before I fall down. I'm going to try uh, Evian water just to kind of get a, a baseline water. So I know Evian tastes good and it's a good water that I like to, I want another water that tastes similar to it. So we're just going to go at random. Go ahead and hand me one at random. Okay. Ooh wee. Huh. That's horrible. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, put that upside down. Oh my God. Hope they don't all taste like that. Whew. That's pretty good. I like that one. Leave that one up. I'm gonna taste this again. That one right there is pretty close to Evian, honestly, I would say. That was a really good water. Not bad. It's good. Well, yeah, leave that one up. That one tastes okay. Tastes a little bit of chlorine, I guess, in it. That one's not bad either. That one's good. It's a good drinking water. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Woo. <laughs> That's just, that's a bad flavor. Ugh. Yeah, upside down. No, that's nasty. <coughs> I'd be curious to see what, what which uh, countries that's from. Ugh. Man, that was. That one's bad. This one's bad, but it's not as bad as the other two. It's this one's got a pretty rough flavor, but it's tolerable. Upside down. Wow.
That one tastes about like the one I just had. That tastes just like the one ju I just had. It's not as bad as those first two down ones, but it's it's pretty rough, upside down. Mmm. Well, this one feels like it's full. <laughs> it's got a funky taste, but it's Drinkable, yeah, leave that one up. That one's not horrible. That one tastes real good. Yeah, that's excellent. Definitely, that's a very good water right there. Mm, almost like the very first one. Man, it's crazy how just the flavor is so different. I hope this is a good one. I don't want that nasty water. Oh. Mmm. Ooh. No way, upside down. Nasty. Ugh. Now that one tastes good. Very pure taste, doesn't have any chemical or just real strong flavor at all. That's a good water. Very good. That one's okay. It's a good water. Leave that one up. Mmm. <laughs> Not terrible. Definitely has a bad, a bad taste to it, though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go upside down. No, not on that one. That's a good one. Pinky out. I'm gonna go on a limb and say, this one's France, maybe. That's a good water. Man, some of them are just nasty. Man. I wonder if it's just regional, like a certain region that's gonna be where they're from or what. Mmm. 
Hmm. Oh my God. Oh. Oh. What sucks is I gotta finish this thing. Oh. Mm-mm. Nasty. Upside down. Oh my God. Oh, please let this be a good one. <laughs> Woo. Mm. This one ain't bad. It's got a little funk to it. I mean, it's not as bad of a funk as some of them other ones. That's a drinkable water. It's not great, but it's better than some of them. I hope we're done with them nasty ones. Good Lord. That's weird. That, is, that one right there doesn't taste like any of them. It's not bad. It's not a nasty taste, but it's different. That's drinkable. It's not bad. We done? Okay. Let me pull this blindfold off here and see what we got. All right. It's bright. Let's see which ones are nasty. Oh, wow. So, Mexico was nasty. Guatemala was nasty. Guam was nasty. France. I knew France would probably be good. Qatar water? Out of all of them, Qatar was good. Hawaii was nasty? Hawaiian water. Azerbaijan water was good. Japan water was nasty. Kyrgyzstan was good. Latvia, Cyprus was nasty. Really? USA was good. Oman was nasty. Mauritania was good. I was I would have lost that bet. Afghanistan. This is a Coca-Cola water from Afghanistan. I think it's made, yeah. Huh, in Greece. Well, there you have it. Uh, that's, um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine of them were good, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them, eight of them were bad. So about half, well, you take the U.S. out, so that, that leaves you with eight and eight. So half of them will taste decent, the other half didn't. Uh, I guess on the next video, we might get some uh, pH test strips or a pH tester and test the pH of each water and see what kind of results we get from that. That'd be interesting to see, um, you know, if, if, if the pH factor has a difference in the taste or not, or, or to me, if I prefer a certain water acidic or alkaline but anyway there you have it folks y'all have a good one